what if God gave us this incredible dominion to, to rule the world, to subdue it, and to steward it, and then said, I want to call my men who are marked by my name to rise up as redeemers to what men have done on this planet. And so we are not to hide, we are not to be alone, and we are not disqualified. And sometimes I guess, but Art, you don't, you don't know what I've done. You don't know how much I've failed. You don't know how many years. Yeah. I've messed up my body with alcohol. I've messed up my marriage or marriages. You don't understand. And God says that you are not disqualified. So by going through this course, it, it gave me the groundwork to what being a good husband look like. But even more exciting than that is my son has come to Christ and <laughs> ah, and my daughter has come to Christ. That would have never happened if I didn't stand up. When, when that happens, the attacks come. You know, When you're out there drawing people to the Lord, the attacks come. And the, the, something very unique about this course was it not only tells you the attacks are coming, it prepares you for those attacks that are coming. I believe the Core 300 is an awesome opportunity for all the men in our church to get involved at a level where they've never been involved before. In some of his final sayings to the Twelve, Jesus promised them peace. But in this world, he said, you will have trouble. We must not move away from the battle, nor pretend there is no war. Far too much is at stake. The peace of God often awaits us at the other end of victory. This is a victory he has already achieved for us, yet one in which we must join with him and our brothers by faith. It is the greatest war of all human history, and it wages still. Will you be Gideon with me to claim your legacy as a husband, as a father, a grandfather, and as a man? An ancient Roman philosopher once wrote, he who would desire peace must prepare for war. Your men are waiting, and your women and children are praying for their men to rise up like Lazarus from the dark tombs of slumber into full engagement as God's warrior and beloved son.